All right. We're going to be cleaning. Uh, we're just going to do this on just, camera. Just the living room. And he's putting down. We're going to be using Rugger Store, which we got from Corey Thibodeau. And uh, the carpets aren't too bad. I hope the lighting is not too awful in here. It's nice out, but we're still kind of on the we're on the shady side of this house. So. And we got uh, overhead lights to work with. Hopefully they'll be bright enough. And we're using, like I said, we're using Rugger Store. We get that from Corey Thibodeau. And uh, we're also going to be using uh, pads from Corey Thibodeau, pad driver from Corey Thibodeau, and a glider that comes through Corey Thibodeau. And I'm going to tell you how to get a hold of him. Uh, you call him at 512-350-1129. And he likes to be contacted through text message only because he doesn't have time for voice calls. And, Everything, but he makes all the parts that we're going to be using on the Aura Corbett today. Plus, he sells this Rug Restore, which is a, is, which is a uh, all-natural product, plant-based, and it does a pretty good job. So, if you're wanting something completely safe to use, it's organic and green. This is a good option. A lot of people, uh, a lot of people, will value that, and you can sell it to your customers because there's nothing harmful in that. <clears throat> All right. So excuse the uh, focus on the camera because low light it kind of hunts around a little bit. I'm gonna try to stay in one spot as much as I can so that I I don't want to get too close because then it's really gonna have trouble focusing. Okay. All right. Now, the glider, which he just sent us this, uh, what, a week ago or so? Yeah, something like that. Yeah. A few days ago. Is that the 14 inch pad? Yeah. Okay. We use a, he sent us some 14 inch pads and some 17 inch pads, and we like both of them. The 17 inches hang out of the machine a little bit further, and they're good if you want to get up close to edges or corners and stuff, so. Yeah, we use those when we know we're going to be near a lot of sideboards or staircases or yeah. something like that. And there's a pad driver that he's that, that, that works really well. Now the glider does make it a little bit easier to maneuver the machine. It makes it considerably easier. And it keeps the RPMs up. See, something the audience don't know, we cleaned this carpet. We cleaned it before, and when you clean it, the carpet pulls real hard one direction. <laughs> With the glider, it don't pull any at all. Yeah, there's a little slope. Most floors are not perfectly flat, and this one has a little slope in it. Either that or it's got some carpet mat. So, you know, the, the yeah, direction. sometimes it's the direction the carpet's laid because of the, uh, you know, the actual nap of the carpet. You know, it has like a grain to it. Yeah, that glider, that completely controls your machine. Yeah. If you contact Corey, he can get you all these things for your orc. And now, uh, the pad the uh, pad driver is for the orc. If you have uh, other machines, though, the, the uh, pads and the uh, glider will still help you. And they have... Uh, uh, bigger gliders available if you have like a 17 inch rotary machine or if you're using a bigger bigger orbital they've got bigger a bigger glider yeah, available this for is that. This is a 6 inch glider that's designed for the orc. Yeah. But they have 9 inch gliders that will fit everything else. Yeah but he, he can give you all the information on that if you are curious. And they're uh, we really like it. It's working nice. Oh man it makes the machine it's like, it's, it's like, it, it makes it like you're working on, on a hard floor instead of carpet. It's, it's as easy to operate as it would be on floors. It completely changes the whole thing. It makes a, right. it makes a half horse machine feel like it's got a one horse motor on it. But, well, yeah, you're but, always... But it's, not, it's not choppy or out of control. Yeah, you're not bogging down on thicker carpets and stuff like you would. And, and sometimes your pad is aggressive enough, it grips real hard and there's a lot of stiction. And that uh, helps uh, 
speed things back up again and speeds up your whole cleaning process. Okay, what I'll do is I'll kind of back my way through the room and I'll work my way in and I'll kind of work my way out. And this will be in the books. All right, check the video description for, I'll put a link for the machine uh, there so you can go find those. And then I'll put Corey's information in there. Like I said, his phone number is 512-350-1129. You just reach him by text message. you got to get one of these gliders. Yeah, the gliders. Uh, if you have an orc, uh, the whole package is nice if you have all three. Well, see, here's how this is. This carpet, we've been in this carpet several times, and it has a heavy pull, and that's that's not even prevalent whatsoever. It's so easy. It's literally like I'm running on a tall floor, and I'm a carpet. I mean, it's amazingly easy. Okay, let me get back in front of you again, because go ahead. Don't want to get too close, because it's really hard to keep it focusing. You'd really notice the difference if you use one of these, if you have a lot of work in one day and just the amount of uh, effort it's going to take you to finish a whole day's work. It's a, it's, it, you'll really notice that the, the longer you clean, the more you notice every little difference you can make that will help you make the job easier and a little bit faster. So the these things... Is, it's so fun to use with a daughter, I'm just going to do it again. Well, <laughs> yeah, it makes it a lot easier it, for it's you. It's easy. It's real easy. Fun. It's funny that something so simple can make a big difference. Yeah. This is your heavy area. By the couches, that's always where the snakes are, where people put their feet. So, but it's coming up. It's all out. This carpet's is spotless. You might show the uh, pad real quick, too, before I shut the camera off. That's it, though. I mean, I can just keep going over and over, but there's no sense. Alright, you can see where the glider was at. <laughs> there's where it all transferred through. And there's the part that was down. Alright. It worked. Hope you guys enjoy that. And uh, I think that's basically it for this one. That's it. So we'll uh, we'll try to make another one as soon as we can. When we get good lighting conditions and everything, that's when we that's when we shoot videos. And a lot of times in the wintertime, kind of, it's, it's hard to find that. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed that. Thanks for watching.